morning everybody hello and welcome to another video i'm half put together finished getting ready with me to go to an event today it's a pr event i've only been to one or two of these in the past but it's like a gifting suite i think and it's just like a pr company they get all their brands together and they invite people over i think it's at a house in beverly hills and they invite people over and you kind of just look at all the new stuff that they've got and that's where i'm going today if you've been following along um i had a root canal last week i just feel like i have to i just have to i have to talk about it i have to draw attention to it it's definitely less swollen than it was yesterday i filmed the q a video yesterday and i talked about it a little there and i'm definitely feeling a lot better but i still feel still feel like it's a little swollen and so i still think that the side of my mouth is a little wonky so it just makes me feel better to tell you guys that look like i feel like my smile is still crooked so i'm leaving in about an hour hour maybe an hour and a half i don't exactly know i got to be there at one i need to eat i need to do my hair i need to pick up my outfit and that will be it and then i'll be walking out the door yesterday i did get like i did put some makeup on stayed in comfy clothes so like i feel like i have not gotten dressed to go somewhere in like four or five days now i'm excited to Put an outfit together enough chit chat i need to freshen up the curls a little bit and we're gonna hang out today i feel like i'm off to a pretty good start the hair is looking pretty good may not need much okay really is holding up i feel like maybe i won't even do anything to it i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna pick out my outfit and then decide if I want to put any curl in it because it's actually looking pretty good. Is it too soon to find an outfit? Should I eat first? No, I'm not really that hungry. Let's pick out an outfit. I got some cute puppies out here. Hi, here's one and here's two. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was sweet. Thank you. Obviously not the slippers. I've got it tucked in and then it's just like kind of hanging back here. So I don't know what I'll do with that. Should I tuck the whole thing in? And are the jeans like, I feel like a darker jean and a tighter jean maybe? But I don't hate it actually looking in this mirror. Maybe different jewelry. You could add like some layers. It's supposed to be hot, so this is probably not the best option, but maybe I could roll the sleeves up if I get too hot. I don't know. Oh, I just ran into this box back here. I think I'm gonna wear it if I can figure out what to do with the back. Should I tuck the whole thing in? Do I need a belt? Fashion is Hard. I do think it needs to be tucked in and then if I tuck it in do I need like a skinny belt and are these jeans too baggy and is it too like oh, there's so many questions I need a stylist and then what's the what shoe you know what I did get some new ones these are new I'm gonna put a sock on I'm just trying it don't yell at me wait is it gonna be wrong to wear a black shirt and white shoes Probably. Do I need a black shoe? Probably. No, no, no. I like the shoe. I just don't like it with the outfit. This room kind of got messy again, so it needs some work. What about these? You guys, I love these shoes. Love, 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 but I don't wear them enough. They get them like broken in, and so they just, I feel like they kind of look too new. You know what I mean? I just don't think the jeans sit right with them. I could do like a dressier shoe, maybe in a belt. Okay. And you know what? I might put you guys on a tripod. My audience. <laughs> I never feel lonely with you two staring right at me. Got a belt. I don't wear belts too often. I don't know why I think belts look so funny on me. I think I like it without the belt. Is that wrong of me? Is that like a fashion faux pas? I think this is the look, except I have two different shoes on. Hopefully I don't walk out of the house like that. And then I think I'm doing my fancy purse. Enough chit chat. Actually, more chit chat. I was gonna tell you what combo lip I'm wearing. One, because I'm about to pack it in my purse. And two, I don't wanna forget what I'm wearing. Cause I think it turned out pretty good today. It was interesting cause I put a little of this, the clear, and I'm gonna say this completely wrong. It's the Tarte Maracuja Juicy Lip. I put this on when I was doing my makeup, like before I kind of started. It's because my lips were like really dry. And then, oh, it's very dirty and I've got it all over my hands. Then I lined my lips with the L'Oreal in, I think this is natural. Oh God, you guys, I cannot see. The lights are shining and I cannot read this. That's the excuse I'm using, that it's the light shining in my eyes. I'm not 
my age. Oh my gosh, this is impossible. I think it's all natural. Didn't that, isn't that what I got? All natural. All natural. All na I still don't know how to say all natural. All natural. Doesn't really matter. So anyway, L'Oreal Color Rich. Color Rich. <laughs> Guys, why do they make these words so difficult? It is all over me. I got to go clean that before I put it in the purse. In my purse. So let's go. Uh, let's go pack my purse. Let's go switch my purse over. That's very exciting. We can do that together. Okay, but that's the combo I'm wearing. And maybe that I did it in that order. I think I feel like you're supposed to do lip liner first and then this. I like that. And then the other day I tried I tried this again because this was the combo that I liked when I wore it to Easter. And I feel like it didn't look the same. I don't know if it was the outfit I was wearing or what, but it just kind of looked like dry and matte, too matte, like dry. And I was like, did I, maybe I washed my lips, the makeup off my lips first. I can't remember what I did. Like, did I, why did it look so good on Easter? And then I wore it. I don't know. This is difficult. Let's go switch my purse over. That'll be so much fun. First things first, I'm still walking around in two different shoes, but I haven't put socks on yet. So hopefully that'll be my reminder. I'm going to clean this before I put it in my purse because it's all over my hands. It's a little dirty. Good as new. We can do a little what's in my bag too. I can never get this camera angle right. Let's see what's in my bag. My mind is everywhere. Like I also want to go, I need to put deodorant on. I need to put perfume on. I may do some like necklace layering. That's what's going on in my head right now. Okay. Okay. I have my card holder. That's going in. I've got a USB adapter. That's not going to go in. I needed that the other day, so I threw it in there. Advil. Hair clip. In fact, I've got two hair clips, so I'm going to just put this one in. I've got a little brush. <laughs> I've got scissors. This is hair cutting scissors. Jules texted me the other day, I guess Friday. Friday, when I went over to her house, she's like, hey, bring the scissors. My hair needs a trim. So I trimmed her hair, and she trimmed mine. And that's why those are in there. They don't need to be in there anymore. I've got some hand lotion and other stories in the scent of Sicilian Sunrise. It's good. It smells delicious. So good. Oh, I forgot this was in there. It's from Rode and it's a peptide lip tint. I might throw that in there because that might look good with this color. Oh, let me put these guys in there. Yeah, I always bring it, but I rarely touch up. I've got this combo that I guess I could take out. Let me be in there. I've got my little birdie in case someone tries to grab me. I can pull it apart and it makes a really loud noise. Dior lip oil that does not need me in there now. I've got my keys. I don't use these keys very often. So it's like, why? Why do I have this on my keychain? I have no idea. It's been there for years. I don't know where I got him. Or why I have some gift cards that I need to see if I actually probably need to take these out the next time I order something online I can try to use them they're old but no they're gonna go in my purse and I'm gonna forget about them I have a pen I have a little lip mirror I've had this for years it's so cute I think it's from Mary Kay I think it might not be but that's what my brain tells me it's from it's just a tiny little mirror Always forget I have that too. I have another <laughs> lip. I have way too many lipsticks. I should do a haul on just that. I have a, a bag. I'm obsessed with lip stuff, but I just now kind of got lip liner lipstick combo going. Maybe I can like run through these now. This is the hourglass in, I don't even know what color. And you guys think I'm gonna be able to read that? Oh, it's slip. It's really pretty. I think it's plumping. Do I need that in there probably right now? No, but now I've got like three lip glosses and at least I got some out. Got these out. That's what was in my purse. Now it's in this purse. Yay! And now I need to go do those other things. Let's go do deodorant, perfume, socks, and decide on the shoe. This turned into a real like get dressed with me. And what's in my purse? I might be making a mis mistake because it is supposed to be like 80 today. It could be like the warmest day of the year so far. So I may be dressed completely wrong. I just slipped those shoes back on. We've got to make a decision on the shoes, you guys. We have to. Let's see what the peanut gallery thinks. Hey, what shoe should I wear? What shoe should I wear? Huh? Oh my goodness. I just love them. <laughs> I don't even know what I just filmed. Upside down shoe reveal. I went with the pointier toe shoe. I think we're going to go with my way. Armani. 
Also, I saw on TikTok this person said you're not supposed to dab them together. I knew you weren't supposed to like rub them and wipe them, but I usually do like the dab dab and then I go up here. She said, don't do that. So let's try that today. I don't know if she's right. I don't know who she was. I'd tell you guys, I don't want to put on too much. And then she says, don't put it on your clothes because perfume smells different on everybody because of like their pH levels or like, like their own personal smell mixes with the perfume, blah, blah, blah. But I always do like to spray it on my clothes. I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna listen to her. I didn't get this side. I don't wanna do too much. That's why I like do that and then I dab and then I dab because of, mm, this seems like, oh, that just seemed like a lot. My everyday is degree, but I use this when I go somewhere nice. This smells really good. The Donna Karen Cashmere Mist. So good, it smells delicious. Oh, I think it's cause I'm swollen, but I feel like my under eye bags are like not great today. I'm gonna chalk it up to the swollen face. That makes me feel better. Should we layer? I think we should. Okay, I'm gonna go with this one. It's already layered and then I think I will probably keep that one on. The rule is, and I've heard this too, is like before you leave the house, you're supposed to take one item off. And it like, we were joking, we we're like, take one off. Like, no, we're going out. And maybe a hair, I don't know, I don't know. But I did take my belt off, so I feel like I did take something off. I feel like I am not spring enough. <laughs> I don't think I wanna change though. I could do a white button down. No, I'm not gonna change. Like, I don't care that much. I care a little bit, but I don't care that much. Oh, oh look! Oh my gosh, I this may be the loudest coffee shop I've ever been in. We're at a coffee shop for a tax meeting. The venue was great, it was hot, we weren't there long, but we're also at the wrong coffee shop, so we're gonna figure that out. We're waiting on Matt to get here, but we just realized we both went to different coffee shops. Now we're at the correct coffee shop. We're not really there, we have to walk a little ways. Now we're gonna go have a tax meeting and talk about taxes. So exciting. I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Daily mineral sunscreen, ooh, yay. That'll come in handy. Oh, some more Versed Clarifying Serum. The Rudest, what is this? Oh, dry shampoo powder. Some hair, skin, and nails. Are these gummies? Gummies. Some blemish drying lotion, blemish, Bye Bye Blemish. Another thing from Bye Bye Blemish. Some patches, I tried one of these there, delicious. They are alcoholic, so drink responsibly. Wait, I know what this is because Jules already opened hers. I wonder if they're all the same colors. This is a great color. I'm so excited about this. And last but not least, Low and Sons. This is this a tote bag? Yeah. That's cute. Okay. That's it. So I also ordered sushi, so I'm waiting for that to get here. That might be it for the day, you guys. Thanks for hanging out with me. And I love you guys. Was that it? I thought I was like, when I get home, I'm gonna do something and I can't remember what it was. Is that for me? Ooh, that's a good one. And a scrub daddy. I use these. I have one in my sink right now. What is this? Who knew that Benefit and Scrub Daddy are teamed up? The original Scrub Daddy. All right. That's really it. I'm going to clean up this mess in here and thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.